Hi peeps, my name is Zena and I am aging ethically. And oh boy, do I have a lot of products and vegan and cruelty free stuff that I like to talk about. But lately, I've been devoting all my energy to Amy's Farm Animal Sanctuary in Queen Creek, Arizona. I do chores around the sanctuary, but I also help Amy maintain her social media, specifically Instagram, Twitter, and TikTok as she is busy 24-7 around the clock taking care of these babies. I've talked about the sanctuary many times. It's such a magical place, you guys. There are a hundred plus animals at the sanctuary. These farm animals, many of them have special needs. They have disabilities. They are handy capable. They are all precious little souls and I love them all with my entire heart. I'm going to give you guys a little tour of my recent visit to the sanctuary. Guys, what are you, Winston? What are you doing, buddy? What are you doing over here? I'm trying to get the leaves. <laughs> hey, Henry. How are you? So the reason why I've been so busy with sanctuary social media lately is because a visitor came to the sanctuary recently and took a video of these two precious souls and it went viral. This is the Duke of Moonshire, he's the calf, and this is Rex the chicken. These two guys have become best friends at the sanctuary and it is the most darling thing you've ever seen in your life. Oh my goodness, people from around the world have been flocking to Amy's social media and asking questions about these two. I thought I'd put together a little video briefly just talking about their backstory. This has been a really big year for the sanctuary. After 10 years of living in one location in Gilbert, we moved the entire farm this summer to a brand new location in Queen Creek. Just a couple of months before the move, Amy rescued this cow named Moonflower and thought she might be pregnant. Well, a couple days after we moved to the new sanctuary, a baby was born and it was Duke. When the sanctuary veterinarians examined the newborn baby, they realized that he was special. He was born with missing bones in his front legs, they were crooked, and he also has dwarfism. Moonflower was such a good mom but she passed away suddenly from bloat this summer and it was so devastating. We all rallied around Duke and you know, he was showered with love and lots of bottles of milk. And then Rex came to us, which is interesting because he is also special. He has a leg deformity as well. Since his mom passed away, Duke has made friends with all of the animals at the sanctuary, but it is his special bond with Rex that has recently captivated the world. Our local Channel 12 News saw the viral video, you guys. They came out immediately to interview Amy, and this is what they put together about the sanctuary and about Duke and Rex. Social media bite storm this afternoon. This is cuteness overload. 12 News brings you an adorable duo out of Queen Creek there. We got to speak to the animal mama that brought these two together. That's his chicken. Meet Duke the calf and Rex the chicken. These two adorable animals have found each other at Amy's Farm Animal Sanctuary. It's a place where animals with special needs are loved and cared for. This little calf was born without bones in his legs and he also has dwarfism. The chicken was brought to us by a neighbor. Um, she was worried that her other chickens were, were going to hurt him. These two have been inseparable since the moment they met. The two became very good friends. They hang out together. Um, the calf gives the little chicken kisses, they take naps, uh, he snuggles under his chin. This uncommon duo have set the cuteness meter to 10 as they pass a million views on social media. They realize that they're both different and they both accept each other despite their differences. 
Oh, I can't stand it. Okay, seriously, that is adorable. Lindsay and I are just Googling over it. Okay, a very sweet ending for two animals who otherwise would not have survived. If you want to help an animal in need, find out how on our website, 12news.com. This video is being shared all over the internet. If you want to see it, go to Earthling Ed's Facebook or Instagram. He shared it. Can you believe it? If you don't know who Earthling Ed is, he's a very well-known, within the vegan community, uh, very outspoken animal rights activist. It was also shared by Reddit on their Twitter. I just can't believe it, and, and it's just so wonderful to see these beautiful babies at the sanctuary where I volunteer get so much love and attention. But in case you need more cute, here you go. I'm going to close out this video with some beautiful pictures of Amy and Duke. Amy's is a non-profit sanctuary. She relies solely upon donations to take care of these babies. Duke is getting custom fitted braces for his front legs and he's going to begin therapy immediately. Amy has the best veterinarians that come to the sanctuary. She has the most loving friends, volunteers, the community as a whole who love her and the animals and it is truly wonderful to be a part of. If you can, please consider a tax-deductible donation to Amy's Farm Animal Sanctuary. I'm going to put the links in the description below and also in the comment section. And if you can't donate money, if you could please share the links, that would be amazing. This place is my heart. Thank you so much, you guys, for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.